Hello guys and welcome to another day with Zamalera. In today's video we will be driving to Myrtle Beach and we're gonna have our nice family Zamalera vacation. Together with my beautiful wife, my beautiful kids, we're going to have lots of fun and this is the highlights of everything that we did today. So I hope you guys will enjoy this video. Hello guys, welcome to another day with Zamalera. In today's video we are driving to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Decided to make a pit stop over here, get some uh, food to eat and keep going. The sponsor of this video is McDonald's and the tasty hash browns that they have to offer at breakfast time turn left onto century all right guys only 120 miles left i think it's nothing we could do it we could do it all today in a single trip Hey guys, we need to fuel up and we're here. All right guys, we are done fueling up. It is time for us to start driving. We just have a little bit left, I think like 20 miles or so. That's it. Hey guys, we are here. We're at the beach. Let me show you what we see now. Guys, it is a beautiful day outside. It's really sunny, so it's time for me to get some sunglasses. So let's see if there's some Ray-Bans in here. And all right, all right, look at all these Ray-Bans here. Lots of aviator style sunglasses from Ray-Ban, and that's exactly what I like. This pair fits me really nicely. I actually like it in the black. And my boys decided to pick out some sunglasses for themselves as well. Kevin and Jason, they're having fun picking out some boy aviator sunglasses. Not by Ray-Ban, of course, but they know they want to be like their daddy. So Jason just found himself a silver looking pair. Ray-Bans that I'm buying are like 190 bucks. Definitely the real deal. Hopefully, they have good warranty on them. All right, guys, we bought the sunglasses. And look at Kevin and Jason, guys. They are so cool. Jason's got the silver pair. And Kevin got the gold pair. They're so happy that they got aviator style sunglasses just like their dad. So let's go boys. Let's have some fun. All right. So we're going to be driving back to our hotel, to our breakers resort and get ready to go to the beach. Okay, guys, we're coming back to our hotel. It is time for us to take the kids to the pool. All right, guys, we made it to Breaker, so we're checking in, and our kids are ready to have some fun. They're sitting here reading their little magazines and brochures. Can't wait to actually go to the sand and run around, and of course, make it to the pool. All right, so now we're walking through the pool area to get to the actual beach let the kids have a little bit of fun with some chess and, and checkers pieces they really love to play with those things and actually we're going to go ahead and um, go to the beach and have a little bit of fun and enjoy ourselves all right guys we made it to the beach and it's time to run on the sand let the kids play they love the sand they love to run their batteries are always charged because when they sleep they just recharge and they just run and run and run kind of like the energizer batteries they just keep going going and going so basically while the kids are having fun we are also enjoying ourselves we're just enjoying the fresh air the beautiful day 
it's so wonderful i mean it's april but it feels like summertime it's really hot outside it's just like you want to run i mean the only thing that's missing is us actually going in the water and stuff like that so while the kids are having fun and playing in the sand we kind of decided to just remember the good old times when me and my wife was dating and this is actually the way we treat our life all the time we've been married for 12 years we love each other even more every single day it's kind of interesting that we're both kind of like this we think the same we think alike basically so like i you know they say like positive and negative attract but we feel like it's nothing but the positive we would like to spread well, it's time the positivity guys the i hope you guys it's like it so we're gonna spend some time at the pool guys and go ahead and go to the sky wheel Well, that was fun. Our kids certainly had the best time of their life, but all this would have made us hungry, so we're gonna go get something to eat and then go on the sky wheel. So anyways, we are leaving our hotel right now. We're gonna go ahead and take a drive to the sky wheel. But before we go to the sky wheel, we'd like to actually get something to eat. And it looks like Taco Bell will be the place. We actually love Taco Bell. So it's time to grab some lunch. I'm hungry for some Taco Bell. My favorite food. Guys, Taco Bell, we got the palm trees here. Oh, my kids love it here. Let me feed you some of this good Taco Bell food. Oh man, Taco like Bell. Oh man, you're making me hungry. Guys, look what I got for little Jason. You like it? All right, let's get you a straw. Okay, Jason, what is this, orange? Tastes good, yeah? Okay. All right, guys, that was some good food. It's time to go to the sky wheel. And all right, we are pulling up on the sky wheel now. There it is, the beauty. And here we are in the parking lot now. So check it out, guys. First, we need to go pay for the parking and let me show you where that is and let's go ahead and get ready uh, to park here so we're gonna choose about six hours so 42 dollars later we are parked hey guys i'm excited about my new pair of sunglasses these are ray-bans and they fit me perfectly all right guys that's our ride right there so i'm gonna go try to buy some tickets man what a beautiful day like finally it feels like Springtime is here, and it is kind of hot, guys. What's up? What's up? What's up? This is the Maletta How To Show vlog on YouTube. All right, I'll subscribe. Okay, looks like we got a new subscriber. That's what happens when you're vlogging every day with the camera. All right, so we're gonna go get the tickets over there. Okay, guys, we are ready. Hey, how are you? Great, how are you doing today? Hello. So, hey guys, we got our passes. That means the flight is on us now. We can finally get on. So, all right, our turn finally came. We're inside of the Sky Wheel, guys. It feels like the helicopter in here. We did take helicopter rides before here at Moto Beach. Uh, the cost, in case you guys are wondering, we're not really trying to like brag or really say anything by it, but it's like 46 bucks for the four of us, two kids, two adults. That's what the price is, in case anybody's wondering. The parking, of course, to park next to the Sky Wheel, it's quite expensive. You might just uh, be able to stay at the hotel. We could have just taken a shuttle, but because we're always out and about, we just end up taking a car. It's a lot faster and the parking itself, like for six hours, it's basically 40 42 bucks um but anyways guys take a look at these views it's views on views guys it is so beautiful it's almost like drone footage but we're just taking it all from above guys inside of the sky wheel it's quite comfortable there's ac and it's every single one of these uh cabins they have like ac in them so you feel quite comfortable never hot never sweaty so it's really interesting, you know, like, and, you know, if you guys are afraid of heights, you're not going to be really afraid of heights on the sky wheel because it does not feel like you're actually that high up for some reason. I hey guys, now it's time for us to leave our hotel again and go ahead and go to Broadway. We would like to walk around here, have some fun, feed the fishes, 
there's lots of them guys they are so big and every year it's kind of like a tradition to always come here and feed the fish and watch our kids grow and of course our kids are quite used to this place they really know everything about it so they just enjoy it just run around have their fun but look at the architecture guys somebody spent a lot of time really designing this stuff to make it look like it's an upside down building that's actually a museum everything's pretty much upside down in it we're not going to be going inside but we're going to be spending a lot of time outside there's a lot of places to go to a lot of boutiques and stuff like that we would have made videos of a lot of the stuff and this is an interesting place here guys there's a lot of stuff to do and of course everything costs money so be prepared to spend a lot if you're trying to have like lots of fun but what we're gonna try to do today is the main thing is just walk around enjoy ourselves enjoy the fresh air let the kids run around feed the fish and we as parents are just gonna like enjoy it right with them guys take a look at this was just a little bit of fish and now we're gonna feed them and all of a sudden there's like huge masses of fish they're just over there just like eating and uh, in between the fish there's like even like other fish that sneak in over there I guess they understand that it's feeding time and stuff like that guys and look at those things they're like donuts it's so cool uh, we actually probably want to ride one of those things at some point they look pretty cool in the water you can just like run in them like a hamster and they're probably not that stable and probably easy to fall but guys you know take a look it's just a beautiful day I know it's like April right now you're pretty much watching a current video we decided to make a full version video for you guys instead of just breaking it up in a lot of different pieces it's been a lot of work trying to get this out to you guys so this is kind of like uh, back at the beach sort of like the boardwalk along the beach you could just walk and enjoy yourself and look at these parrots guys they're so smart the man that actually owns these parrots he just talks to them like two little sons and they actually listen to him it's really cool so you could take pictures of them video and whatnot so it's always kind of like interesting and a lot of stuff to do at Myrtle Beach guys every time you come down but this is the way a vacation should look like and this is the way we always spend our vacation whenever we come down to Myrtle Beach or elsewhere but Myrtle Beach is one of our favorite places we kind of have a family tradition to just basically keep coming to Myrtle Beach uh, anytime we get a chance that's actually what we love to do so anyways guys look at these beautiful sceneries here so we're walking around and stuff like that and getting a little bit of hungry so we would like to actually find a good place to eat and we're looking around seeing you know which one of these restaurants will be suitable to eat something and while we're looking for some food there's all kinds of machines and stuff and kids actually want some tickets playing with those things uh that little friendly dog we just met and that guy just walks around with those parents just kind of like enjoying himself look guys like people are playing like volleyball and stuff like that but anyways guys we are getting hungry and it's time for us to go grab some dinner so we're gonna just walk to the pier uh it's called pier 14 we just gotta make it down there and grab a bite to eat see what they have to offer pretty sure like it's gonna be good tasting food you know because anytime you walk around and breathe in fresh air and stuff like that you get tired and you get really really hungry so it looks like my kids found something else to ride they're always trying to ride on something so we're just kind of like hanging out guys and going inside and stuff like that and of course um, every time we're vlogging and a lot of people they meet us and stuff and they say hello to us and stuff like that um, we kind of thought hey we just gonna sit outside but it's a little bit windy here and our kids are trying to color with their coloring books and stuff so we made it inside so while we're waiting to order our kids are coloring and stuff like that and we take lots of pictures and what we ordered is a big burger basically like it's their special type of burger that they cook in a restaurant it's pretty tasty and unique and looks like she just brought my order and stuff like that I actually uh, joked a little bit with this lady and I said um, it's Friday uh, can I get my check and she kind of thought it was funny but anyways guys the video is over thank you so much for watching god bless you and take care of yourself